Hey friends, have you ever heard of the Jennifer Aniston salad? Rumor has it, this is what she ate every single day when she was on the set of Friends. So, I'm gonna show you our version. Let's go. You just know it's going to be good with this beautiful spread of foods. We'll start by prepping all of our ingredients. First up, some cucumber. This will add a refreshing crunch to the salad and is super good for your skin and staying hydrated in general. Cut it up into sections, then into small bite-sized pieces. While I do this, let's talk about this salad's reputation, shall we? Even 20 years after the series ended, Jennifer Aniston and her co-stars are still icons, thanks to their lovable roles in the hit series Friends. Apparently, Jennifer ate a salad similar to this all the time. And wow, if that's true, what a great diet. This recipe is adapted from one she shared just a few years ago that she called her perfect salad. And hey, if it works for her, it works for us. Let's just gather these up to set aside until we're ready to assemble. Next up, some red onion. Chop it in half first to make peeling a little easier. What a pretty color this one is. Then, with each half, make cuts like this almost all the way through to the root end. Then, turn it around and cut the other direction to get the perfect diced pieces. It's up to you how big of pieces you want. These add a great crunch and flavor, but I prefer it when they mostly blend in with just small pieces. Chop it a little more if needed to get the size that you want. It's so satisfying to see the layers break up like this. Then, repeat everything for the other half. The flavor of red onions is pretty hard to beat, but we totally get it that it's not everyone's favorite. Or maybe you're sensitive to raw red onion. In that case, you can substitute some chopped green onion to get a similar flavor punch. Now let's prep some pistachios. You can buy them unshelled like this to save some time. And then all they need is a rough chop. These will add an incredible salty sweetness to the salad, as well as an awesome punch of protein and crunch. You can add or substitute other nuts if you prefer. Moving on. Now, what's a good salad without some cheese? Feta is the go-to for this one because of its tanginess, and it will add an important creaminess component to the finished salad. Just break it up with your fingers like this before adding it with the other ingredients. Ready. Now for some greens. First up is mint. We're going to first start by removing the leaves from the stems. This is where we think Jennifer Aniston was getting some inspiration from tabula, which is a Middle Eastern salad that uses fresh herbs like mint and parsley as its key components. Mint is jam-packed with antioxidants, is great for your digestive health, and is super refreshing. Once the stems are removed, roughly chop all the leaves. And set them aside in a bowl for later. Now we'll repeat the exact same process with some parsley. Just pop off all those leaves. Just so you know, parsley and mint stems are technically safe to eat, but for this recipe, we prefer to remove them in order to avoid any bitterness and to keep a more consistent texture. Parsley leaves are loaded with healthy nutrients, including folate, iron, vitamin K, and more. No wonder this is a key addition to the recipe.
Finally, let's prep a lemon. Just slice it in half for now, and we'll revisit it at the end. All right, now all of our ingredients are ready. Look at this gorgeous spread. Here we have everything that we just prepped, plus some more additions. Chickpeas, olive oil, salted pepper, and some pre-cooked and chilled quinoa. Let's start with that. We're going to use about a cup total of quinoa in our salad here, but feel free to add more or less depending how much you like this seed. Quinoa is nutrient dense and is a great source of protein, minerals, and antioxidants. We recommend prepping it ahead of time so that it can cool down before mixing it in with everything else. And speaking of everything else, let's get rolling with this assembly. We'll add in our chopped cucumbers, crumbled feta, our de-stemmed parsley and mint, a can's worth of rinsed and dry chickpeas, the diced onions, and last but not least, our lovely pistachios. Now we'll mix our dressing right into the bowl. Drizzle everything with some olive oil, then give a hearty pinch of sea salt. Okay, maybe another one. Then some ground black pepper. Finally, we're going to get the juice out of this lemon. This will be the perfect finishing touch and add some tasty acidity to our dish. All right, let's stir this up. It's fun to watch all these ingredients come together, and it smells amazing too, thanks to that mint. Be sure to mix it thoroughly so that everything is well incorporated and the oil and lemon nicely coat it all. Now, you can either chill it and save for some awesome meal prep, or go ahead and serve. All of these ingredients hold up great in the refrigerator, so you really could have a whole week of lunches right here. Thanks to all the protein in this, it can be a balanced full meal on its own. Or, of course, it makes a great side dish. With that, it's ready. I'm sure Jennifer Aniston would agree that even if it hasn't been your day, your week, your month, or even your year, this perfect salad will be there for you. All right, let's give this a taste test. Mm -mm -mm. It has the perfect balance of flavor and crunch. I can totally see why she'd eat this every day. You should try it. <laughs>